So within this Red 4 video, I'll bring you the location of 4 guaranteed legendary weapon drops, and also a trick you can use to get legendaries elsewhere. How's it going guys, my name's DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so some of these will require you to have a lot of picks and rewire kits. These can be brought from the last and found vendor within the fire station, or obviously be looted out and about. Okay, so first up guys, we have this one right here. Follow the path I take to this building. Once you get here guys, go up the back as I do, and the back door requires a lock pick. You can use a lock pick or just jump through the window. It will set off an alarm but there is a terminal inside the building to deactivate this alarm. But it's no issue dealing with a few vampires that may appear here. Within this building you will need a lock pick to get into a room and then you will need another one to get into this safe. And there guys you have your legendary. Okay, so this next one is quite a run away, but doesn't require any lock picks or rewire kits, as you can simply just break the window and enter this place. So follow the path I take on screen now and go get this legendary. Again, when you do break the window, an alarm may go off, but there should be a terminal inside if you are struggling with the enemies that will come. But yeah guys, here you go. This is a legendary weapon, which is 99% of the time, of my experience, will be a shotgun. Okay, so the next one is located within a pawn shop. This one does require a lock pick and a rewire kit. So follow the path I take on screen now guys and go and get this thing.
Okay, so the last legendary weapon location, which is guaranteed, is located right here on the map. It is a mission away from the fire station, but there is a fast travel spot uh, right near it, which I'm going to use, guys. Otherwise, I'll be running here about five minutes, which will make the video too long. But once you get here, guys, this place is swarming with enemies and vampires. And it also requires you to have a lockpick. But yeah guys, go get this thing. Okay, so with the guaranteed legendaries out of the way, did you guys know that random weapons fans scattered around the map? Non-legendaries can actually be rotated and turned into legendary weapons for instance weapons that you may find on a floor not in a chest or a safe or anything like that these can actually appear as a legendary if you find one and it isn't a legendary you can actually turn it or have a chance of turning it into a legendary to do this guys it's quite simple once you find that random weapon just lying there waiting for you to pick up, simply fast travel away from it and run back. Also quitting out the game and coming back has a chance for the weapon to again change, change its rarity and actually become a legendary. I tried and tested this and got it to work on two different occasions. As you can see on screen now this random weapon which I found was that typical usual crappy rarity. I ran back here about 5 times and it eventually turned into a legendary weapon. So yeah I mean it's a bit long and I'd rather just play the game but at least you know this can be done. Also another trick, any of the guaranteed legendaries I showcased earlier, you can actually rotate these for different ones too, by quitting out the game and coming back to them before you picking them up. So for instance, you grab one out of a safe or you open up a safe, you can see the legendary there is for your taking, if it's one you don't want or one you already have, simply quit out the game guys and then come back here. If it's one that requires a uh, lockpick or a rewire kit, you will have to reuse those to get the legendary again. But hey, there's a chance it will rotate. But yes guys, just a simple tip there. And there we have it, the end of the video has arrived. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, it really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys, I will see you on that next one.